<laughs> Alrighty, welcome back. We are uh, underground, and Olivia is scared of the dark. Not surprised. I'm scared. Olivia! We'll go back up. Yeah. <laughs> Olivia kind of acts like a, uh, a kid sometimes, where I get that it's supposed to be just like, hey, before we adventure in this area, let's turn on the lights. But Olivia's just like, I'm scared. Please turn the lights on. <laughs> okay. The actual reason I'm going upstairs is because if this works, I'm keeping it in the video. If it doesn't work, I'm not keeping it in the video. Okay. Two things I wanted to try out. Okay, that doesn't do anything. It looks like I'll be... I'm tempted, okay? I'm, like, really determined. Were you thinking about this? Did you, like, lie awake at no, night? No, no. It was as I was editing it, I was like, why didn't I try and do the thing that the game talks about? Okay. No. I'm not stupid. <laughs> we'll find a way up. There has to be, yeah. Maybe it's, like, a, uh, maybe it's a tool that you get later. It's a surprise tool. Um, I'm actually also going to go sit on the bench really quickly to get my health back. Before you venture into the darkness. Yeah. Wait, can I just walk through here? <sighs> now I'm mad. Those horrible Goombas showed up right around the time the toads disappeared. I heard loud noises coming from Peter's castle too. Just what is going on? Oh, okay, cool. So it doesn't look like there's... And no matter what, even when you descend, I think you just fall. Like... <laughs> 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 Wow. It's a shmi. Imagine finding... Oh. Look, someone's here. Who's there? What the fuck? You got glasses. Yes, I'm Savid. Oh, Mario. I had to run down here and hide from those horrible folded soldiers. Pardon me, I should introduce myself. I'm the curator Musée Champign Champignon in Tone Town. Uh, is that like art sommelier? I thought I I infle I've like inferred the word muse as in someone who inspires other others but doesn't actually do any work. I think he's an art collector. Raise it. It's a museum with a splendid collection of object, music, treasures, origami, and other wondrous items. Yeah. Jesus, he keeps getting closer. I know. I don't like this. <laughs> And we even have managed to acquire the legendary Super Marino Sea Vessel. God damn it, that name. <laughs> I do hope you'll come visit soon. We're open even with all the organized crime we've seen as of late. Uh, what is this toad? Is this toad a staunch capitalist? No, uh, this toad is acting like uh, he should have a uh, like a mafia accent. He looks and the music kind of like, sounds like he's actually just the toad version of Professor Egad. Yeah, like, like I... I I do hope you'll come visit soon. We're open, even with all of the uh, the organized crime we've seen as of late. Something that I have no, nothing to do with. No, no, read it again. <laughs> or organized. This game. I hate this game. The writing in this game. <laughs> also. <laughs> wow, Olivia's me. Olivia is talking a lot of smack for someone that's literally just two dots. <laughs> Yeah, but also... His face uh, is just two black dots on a... <laughs> uh, spoken like a true white piece of paper. White and yellow. Uh, it <laughs> should go back to town and check out the musée. The uh, That's muson. like uh, when my cousin got engaged, we always referred to his uh, spouse-to-be as his uh, fiance instead of fiance, <laughs> just to um, piss them off. I do have to say before you leave this room, just imagine like you go down into the sewer, right? And you just see a portrait of you and your significant other on the wall. Like how, that's terrifying. <laughs> that is the true terror. I don't know if that would, if that or an actual scary face would freak well, me out He's more. famous. He's world famous. Is he world famous? Yeah. What else has he done? Also, are they even a couple? Tune in for our Mario fan theories. Mario lore. Oh. Oh. Friends, no friends. The friends. Ah! <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this. Fuck.
You have so many coins. Oh my gosh. You better be able to like buy a house by the end of this. It's like on the walls. It's all over the walls. They blew up. <laughs> they, oh god. Uh. It's not how fuck. it works. <laughs> I just wanted to do it without them. I took so much damage for no reason. It's because you didn't get the puzzle right. Okay, it's your punishment. Hmm. There we go. We're back up. I don't like, I, I don't. Remy, no. Remy. Remy, no. I wish there was like an item that would let me collect confetti like further around me, you know? There might be. You might get like, I don't know, a magnet ring or something. Oh shit. <laughs> that was pretty funny. I mean, same. <laughs>
There he is. Pour one out. Pour one out for uh, my dead brother. I hope you've been practicing your Luigi voice. Fuck. Because if he's alive, <laughs> we hit the we hit the goal. So you got to do it. <sighs> your brother's hat. Someone wrote Luigi inside in very small letters. Is that something Luigi would do? Where could he be? Help me. That's your Luigi voice? No, that's just my, I'm buried under a pile of rubble and we don't know who this is yet. It's Luigi. It almost like that just spoke to me in Luigi's voice asking me for help. It's almost like I can hear his Look, voice. I know I had to take the bet before because it wasn't Bowser from episode one. How much do you want to bet? It's not actually Luigi. It's just a Goomba that's painted green. Or it's like Luigi. a Goomba in green. It's Luigi. <laughs> Are you willing to bet that it's not Luigi? Because I think this one's pretty clear cut. No, you're right. You're right. I just... This is, this is, the, this is exactly the last, like the last time that, uh, that we lost a bet. Yep. Well, it looks like you're going to lose it this time. <laughs> no, I'm not betting anything. I really don't want to take a shot. It's like two, two in the afternoon. Yeah, it's two in the afternoon on a Friday. Um, oh God, what do, I, what do we want Luigi's voice to be? I, I, I really haven't even thought about it. It's been days. I know. I've, I'm, I've run out of time. I've missed the deadline. It's been like six days. <laughs> um, I feel like it's going to be like offensive. <laughs> I'm really how, how worried how about it's going to be about this. Until we see Luigi on the screen, you don't have to do the Luigi voice. Okay. But as soon as he is. <laughs> I'm holding a gun up to her head. Yeah, because there's there's no A. You know, there's not like a... It's not like I'm uh, all folded up somewhere. If it's not Luigi, I'm going to shit my pants. <laughs> right now. I'm just um, going to do it on command. Yeah, I will. <laughs> okay. Well. Okay. Luigi's dead already. Can I keep this hat as a memory? I didn't know Luigi, but I miss him anyways. Yeah. Thanks, Olivia. It's too bad that it has to be this way, but we can't let us get we can't let it get us down. We will hold and treasure your hat forever, Luigi. We're on to it somewhere. I'm pretty sure he's in the pot. Oh okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. He asked me here then. Okay, cool. He's definitely okay. I'm not an idiot. He's definitely in the pot. Nope, never mind. Dorito time. Dorito time. Doesn't fold arms. He's in the wall. Doesn't fold arms. Oop. There's my son. I feel weird. Okay. Whew. That's some more like it. I'm glad you're okay, Luigi. Not that we had any doubt. My name's Olivia, by the way, I owe Mario big time for all his help. By the way, as someone who's been there, I'm wondering how you ended up trapped between dimensions. Let's see. A shy guy put me there, but not a regular shy guy. It was... thick. And edgy. Before I do it, I can't I can't keep this accent up. It's like it's not, not an accent that it's you're not, doing anyways. It yeah. sounds like your Olivia voice, yeah, actually. Yeah, that's- I have one voice, it's my voice, and that's it. <laughs> How awful for you, but at least you didn't get turned into a folded soldier. Oh, but I do have some good news. Your hat survived without you. My, My hat! <laughs> but what happened to the whole castle? And where's the Princess Peach? Princess Peach! <laughs> princess of Patch. I thought you'd be happier to see the hat while my brother kidnapped Peach in her castle. Olivia has the strangest list of priorities. I don't know. Like It's very weird. We're on our way to stop him right now. It's a long way there and the streamers are blocking us. The streamers, all the Twitch streamers. Twitch streamers, you got all your faves up there. You got um Dr. Just, oh, nope, never mind. Not him anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's right. I was gonna go look for the key to Peach's castle. We got locked in, remember? Mario's always saving me, so I wanted to do something nice for him for a change. Okay. 
This one seems like a good line to practice your Luigi voice. I don't, is this, this whole playthrough is just gonna, like, I'm not gonna nail it until the end, and then Luigi's gonna be like, ha ha, I'm fucking off for the rest of the game. <laughs> How great would it be if at the end of this game, you're like, I can do a perfect Luigi impersonation. Yeah, and then, and then Luigi says one last line, I get it, I nail it, right? Like, I nail the line, and that's it. But think about all the other games we could play where you'd have the best Luigi impersonation. No, see, I, I think that would take away the charm. If it wasn't. Also, look how much rounder Mario is. Like, just... Yeah. Just do it with body. an Italian accent. I can't do an Italian accent. Okay. Oh, I love him. I love Luigi. I'm really happy to see my hat again, but I've got to, but I've still got to find that key. Let's go. Well, we definitely might need the key if we, if we make it into the castle, so let's pin all of our hopes on Luigi. That sounds like sarcasm. Good luck, Luigi. See you later. Hi, yoink. I do need the hat. What if it was just like really serious? I do need the hat. <laughs> Yeehaw! He just yeehawed. <laughs> so you know Luigi's gay, because he yeehawed? Yeah. Only the gays can yeehaw. Yeah. Only the gays naturally yeehaw. Yeah. Yeah. It's actually written in the rule book. Yeah. Yeehaw. Do rules. Ye yeehaw. Yeehaw. So now that we know he's okay, what should we do next? <laughs> I mean, we're still at a Peach's castle, but we should look around for clues first. Hmm. Well, I needed to go off to the right, didn't I? Because that's where the, the go-kart was. Can, but the go-kart's heavy, unless, like, Luigi's just fucking downed a bunch of pre-workout, and you get out there, and he's just, like, lifting it. Luigi could lift it. <laughs> he drove it. Yep. <laughs> he lifted Someone it. Someone drove that pile of junk. Somebody moved that pile of junk that was here. It was probably Luigi, wasn't it? I wish my brother were as kind and thoughtful as yours. I love the skid marks. <laughs> like, he just I'm not a huge fan of Luigi's skid marks. I'm on divorce. <laughs> okay, uh, with that one, we're gonna end this episode. See you in the next one. Tomorrow. With Luigi skid marks. Yeah, and just with a better Luigi impersonation or else I'm gonna fire. <sighs> Getting an actual Luigi impersonator. Guys, help. Please.